Hi, welcome. In this video, we want to learn how to create square video for Instagram. It will have a title, then it will have the video playing, then it will have, it will have a captions of your word and all that. Let me click on play on this video so you can see the progress bar and... Um, so it comes with the title, the progress bar, like the way Gary V does his own and is very, very professional if you are doing Instagram videos. So how do we create this video? What we need to do is we are going to download a software called Camtasia. You can go to their website, TechSmith, and um, you download it. Or you just Google Camtasia, it will take you to their site. You can download it for 30 days trial and all that. So once you download it, now it will be on your PC. And um, so this is the software. So when you start it, it will come like this. So this is Camtasia now. And um, you can either use it, for instance, now I'm using it on my MacBook Pro. You can either use it on your Windows or any of the other computers, okay? So now you can either click on New Project or you click on New Recording. So let me do New Project because I already have my videos ready. So I'll click on it now and um, I can start creating my videos, okay? So the very first thing you do now is um, you actually create your project title here your project settings so i'll click here now and at the top here and i'll click on project settings so i'm going to make my project i'm going to use instagram size which is 1080 by 1080 that's a square video as at now it's on 1920 by 1080 which is an hd video so i'll just make this 1080 and i'll click on this bell so that it will not be fixed okay you can see now so now we have 1080 by 1080 so I'll just click here on apply. You can see it comes with a square video. So the next thing I'll do now is to come here and click on import media. So the videos that you've created already with your webcam, with your professional camera, with your phone, you just um, import it here, either in MP4 or in any file. Okay, so let me just look for one of my videos and um, upload it here. So let me look for this one, okay? So I'll click here on import now. So what I'll do here is um, you can just drag it to the timeline or you right click and you see as to timeline and playhead. So you can see, so it's here like this now. So the next thing I'll do now is to put the title of the video. So I'll just go here and I'll click on annotations. So here I'll click here on ABC, which is the title. So I'll just click here now, just double click and drag and place it here okay so you can click on the text now just double click on the text and um, start typing so i can say how to how to create a webinar with pre-recorded video okay so i'll click here on this undo here yeah, i'll just drag it so that it will be straight line here. So I've dragged it a little. So depending on how you, you liked it. So once I click here now, just click on it. Then here you see click on properties. So it will show you the properties. So this is where you go. You can now decide to change the font color to maybe something like this. Or you can just click on the pencil tool and maybe take a color within your background or let me say color within my shirt. Okay. So I'll click here now. And I'll click here again and click a color within my shirt. Let's I want to use this. So I can decide to change, increase the size. I can decide to make it bold and all that. You can decide to make it center. Okay, so let's leave this because we don't want this video to be too long. So let's say I'm cool with this. The next thing I'll do now is to put closed caption. That is whatever I'm saying, it will be showing it in text. It is called caption. So it makes your video go viral, most especially on YouTube because it's very good for search engine and there is a lot of people who don't have time to listen to your video but they can read so it's very very important to add captions to your video now how do you add captions to your video when you have your video ready you can upload this to this website it is called rev.com and um, they actually transcribe your video one minute for one dollars okay so for instance let me log into my account so once i logged into my account now once you've created your account with them you can just upload your video. So if you are doing Instagram video, so one minute is actually a dollar, which is around 300 and something naira, okay? 
So I can click here on place new order and upload my videos. Okay. So if I click here, place new order, you now choose caption. Okay. Because I want to create this caption so that it will be in my video. So whatever I'm saying, it will be sharing it in writing. So I'll just click here on upload and um, upload the video. Okay. So I'm not uploading any now. So once you upload your videos and um, they will now transcribe it usually an hour or two but they will tell you it's 24 hours but they are very very fast so once your job is done so like for this video now i have done this i've paid for them all i'll do here now is just to click here and i'll click here on download so you see many options so dot srt is the option we we'll use in videos so whenever you are seeing videos playing on tv where you see text rolling it is called dot srt so depending on the software and themes you are doing but for YouTube, Instagram, and most of these videos, we actually use .srt. You can use Facebook and all that. So once you download it on your PC, we'll now go back to our software now. So let me go back to my software now and um, upload it. So what I'll do here now is in the Windows here now, I'll now go to Windows here. Sorry. I'll go to More here. So you can now see interactivity and all that. Okay. Let me import the, the caption. So I'll click here now. You see library. No, you see import and you click on caption. Okay. So I'll look on my system now and look for the captions that I got from webrev.com. So this is it now. So I'll just click here on import. So my captions has been imported now. So the next thing I can do now, you can now click here on view and click here show caption track so that you can see because sometimes they might made an error so you can correct it. So for instance, now if I should play the video now, let's see. In this video, I want to talk so about you can see this is my caption here. Okay. So I can stop it and increase the caption size. All I need to do now is to click on these captions in our timeline here. Okay or you click here on this captions here and then um, you click on this um, settings icon you see caption settings so here and i can increase the size of my caption let's say 50 is okay i can decide to change the color to maybe the color so i have in my videos to let's like, say this color in my shirt for branding purpose and all that okay now if i should play the video now you see you see that, um, okay, I'll click on OK. If you see yeah, now, you see that the color has changed, okay? So now the last thing I'll talk about now is to create the progress bar so that people will know where the video is going, how many minutes, how many seconds, the way Gary V does his video and professionally. So how do I do that now? I'll go back to... So because of space now, let me do the progress bar before I put our transition. So let me click here and delete our transition here. So what I'll do here now is I'll now add our progress bar, which is here. So I'll go here now to annotations and click here and then put it here. Okay. So here now I can now drag it to take the space and make it very small, very tiny like this. So here yeah, now, I'll just click here and drag so that it will take the entire video space, okay? So sorry, first, you have to delete the text. So let me delete the text here. So let me make it now very small, very small, okay? So this is it now. So what I'll do now is to put our transitions in it, okay? So I'll come here now and I'll click on transition. I'll scroll down and look for slides to the right. So I'll just click here, drag it and put it on top of it. So I'll drag it here now. So you can see the way it is, so it's there now. So if I should click on play now, you see it. Video, so you can see the transition is coming. So this in is the progress bar, webinar, okay? So the last thing I'll do now is just to put our captions back. So I'll go back to file this time around, click on import captions and look for my captions here and click on import. Okay. 
So our caption is there now, so you can now play it's and see how it looks like. Out, so it's very simple. You can see the way it is now. So what I'll do now is the last part is I'll just like render it, produce it as a video. Just type mm -hmm. Control E, which is Control Export, or Command E if you are using Mac, and like this. So I'll just put the title of my videos and all that. So once I click on Export, the video is ready for Instagram. So this is how you create your Instagram videos like Gary V, that has a progress bar, and um, all that. Thank you for watching this video.